Hi, welcome to Blind Owl Outdoors. We hope you enjoy our channel and if possible could you please join our Patreon page. We really need your help. It's been a long hard road. Thank you. Hi. Welcome to Blind Owl Outdoors. Well we're going to do another video with Cooking with Mara Fee today. And what are you doing today? I will clean and cook milk fish. What's the dinner? What's it called? Uh, Ritong Bangos. Okay. That sounds, like, that, sounds like a, fish. that sounds like a likely story, but okay. <laughs> milk fish with what? With uh, fried milk fish, and I, I will put a uh, so so one, what you call it? I have no idea. Uh, uh, tomatoes and uh, ginger and uh, soy okay. sauce. All right, well. <laughs> Uh, Dive into your fish, what are we going to do? Uh, she says she's going to clean the fish, and right now we're cooking at the same time, we're cooking some hot dogs, but that's another video. Yeah. You already gutted it already, huh? Oh, Okay. So now you're going to, what are you going to do, what do you call that? Uh, scaling. Scaling, okay. <laughs> Very good, huh? that's right. That's a guess. Yeah, that's correct. If we're talking English, what's the word in Visayan? Himbis, huh. Himbisan. Okay. Remove. Remove the scales. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Kind of tough one, isn't it? Yeah, because it's big. Oh. That's the. Should give you my fish scaler. That probably make it easier. Oh, do you have one Sure. I got a knife that's it's like a saw on the back side, a smooth saw. It oh. scrapes the scales right off. Mm. Actually, probably work better with the back side of the knife. Backside? Oh, no. The injure. Yeah, no, you don't cut yourself. <laughs> and the sharp, the flat edge of the knife usually works better. But mm. Amazing how I know all this stuff, huh? Mm. You thought I was just a helpless, helpless American that didn't know how to cook. I I didn't say that. Uh, that's what you think, though. So. You cook that. different. Very different. Oh, I cook Filipino cook. Okay. Oh. You cook Filipino cook, huh? <laughs> <laughs> okay, you say so. I cook Filipino style. Okay. Alright. Alright, we'll be back in a minute. What you gonna do? I will. Um, Cut the fish like this. That's yeah, a scary looking knife there. Okay. Someone said it looks like it needs to be sharp. It's pretty sharp. Oh. Looks to me. Maybe a lesson on filleting so you don't have any bones in there. Make it so much easier. Mm. You leave it all together when you half it? But then? You leave it together as you half it or take it apart? Leave it to get together. That's how you fry it? Mm. That's, what these that's what those ladies were doing at the market that day. Yes, that cut. I okay. do like this. A long time ago. Mm. Yuck. <laughs> yeah, when it's not cool. But this is how he looks. <laughs> Look at that. Mm. Big one. This is a big one, yeah. Mm. I put on. Gonna marinate it, right? Mm. Lemoncito. Lemoncito. What's the English this one? Lemoncito? No such thing in English. Oh. Uh. Never saw one before I got here. 
Oh. It's like a little lime or a lemon in between. Oh. Some sort of citrus fruit. Oh, citrus. It's a local tree that grows here. Mm -hmm. I know. Squeeze them. Squeeze. Save the seeds. We'll throw them out in the ground somewhere. Yeah. Never know. Um, here's something for everybody that's watching. If anybody has any access to heirloom seeds, I don't like asking for things, but that's something that we can really use here is any type of seeds that, that aren't hybrids that we can reuse the seeds on when we plant and harvest the vegetables. Uh, I want to get together with Philip and we want to use Philip's land. He has some uh, brilliant gardens but he just has no access to seeds and then we'll help him work the garden and split the harvest with him. Uh, we'll do like like a share crop on one, one big long garden or something like that. Oh. Yeah, that's it. We got something else to put in there? Put Pepper? Okay, good morning. Okay. And Gamai means what? Gamai little. Oh, I forgot that. <laughs> but little. Some people are watching our, our the sign, and some mm -hmm. are Tagalog, and some are English, so. Yes. Probably yeah. even some other countries involved there, too, I bet. A bit soy sauce. Soy sauce. If they're getting low on soy sauce. Somebody oh, have a big oh, bottle over there. Right here. Okay. I see you yeah. still haven't used this nice bottle I bought you, huh? Uh, I will use that today. I heard that about nine times now, but okay. Little bit vinegar. Little bit vinegar. That's how I eat. About an ounce or a couple of tablespoons, maybe? Mm -hmm. That's it. And Wait let it, for it. Let it soak for a while? Mm -hmm. And then you're going to fry it, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. That's the meat. All right. All right. And we'll be back right, in a second. We're back. And. Marfis. Just stuff for her ingredients. Her fish is still marinating. Mm. She's using the other alcohol stove with her pan because she wants something a little hotter than a charcoal fire today. Uh, let's, let's do this part here. Oh, I'm just pouring out sweat. I just had a hot dog for lunch. That was pretty decent. Yeah. <laughs> I will use this for what do you call that? Thing? No idea. Just like deep. Okay, like a sauce. <laughs> uh, like that. A dip, huh? What do you call that? In no idea. Movie? I would call it a sauce or something. Sauce. Huh? A dipping sauce, maybe. I don't. I don't like know. that one. Okay, if you say so. It's raining. No, it's not raining. That's your pot, tingling. Very hot and humid today. Sun's not really out, but it's it is beyond sticky. Mm. I went to Talaboon today to get a driver's license. That took the whole morning. That was pretty interesting. There's a little thunder in the distance, yes. Okay. Is the cats making that noise? <laughs> we got the cats out in the chicken cage and they're with some food. They seem like they're pretty happy. Mm. Not making any noise, which is pretty nice. Okay. Oh, you yeah, have a ceramic knife today. Okay. Like it. Wondering why it was cutting good. Mm. Having the black blade, it, you don't recognize it. It looks just like a regular knife. Mm. Yeah. Have a couple bigger ones if you want them, but. Mm. Get used to that one first, I guess, huh? Mm, I like this. You need to make a little block for them so they just stick in so you can have it oh. on the wall or you can take whichever one you want. Mm. I was just keeping one, <laughs> keeping you with one at a time because you, you destroy them. Mm. That's why I only gave you one. Well, save those seeds for me. I'll, yeah. I'll clean them out and plant them. No 
no garlic today? No. Okay. That's this one and the knife doesn't really seem that sharp. Sharp enough. Mm. And I put soy sauce. Oh, in the your dipping sauce? Dip, yes. Okay. Like that. So about a tablespoon. Mm. Yeah. So about a tablespoon or so. Vinegar. A little vinegar. And I, I put. Um, Two tablespoons, it looks like. What? Canung. Canung what? That lemon you keep pot. asking me canung. I have no idea what you're talking about. How, how could I possibly know? Lemon. Put a lemon in there? Okay. Yeah. Put a little bit of sin. Salt. Chip chip. Okay. Little bit sugar. Looks good. Smells good. How was your dinner last night at the restaurant? That's very good. Wasn't that fancy? Yes. I put the video up. Everybody saw that today. Uh, so we'll, we'll put this one up tomorrow for them. I'll get lemon. I have lemon here. I'll get some more. Where are they at? Inside the house. Alright, we'll be back in a second. Mark had to go in and get some lemon cedos. The seeds, huh? Yeah. Cut them right in half that time, huh? Yeah. You can't do that with a regular knife, can you? No. Put this one. A little chili pepper in there, huh? Yeah. Oh, it does. One only. Just one, huh? Yeah. Okay. Wicked. That's quite uh, a little a little sour, sweet and sour, probably. Mm. A little spice. Squeezing the lemons in there, okay? Mm. Smells good. Think your pan's getting pretty hot over there. Just let that sit. Okay. Got some real hot oil here. Watch out, it's gonna sizzle you. If you drop it in like that. Alright, we'll take a look at the fish. Not quite as hot as it was, but that was really hot before. Stuck in there, huh? That's what you want? You want it stuck like that? Yeah. Spatula it up, loosen it up? Yep, it's soft. Let's get it harden up first. Mm -hmm. Alright. Cooking dinner and kind of started raining a little bit. I got caught in the rain like that this morning going to town to get my driver's license. I was soaked to the bone all morning. Alcohol, so I have to load it back up again. There you go. <laughs> you don't like that way, huh? I like that. Yeah, okay. Take just a second for it to start coming out the jets again. What's this pan for? I was trying to say it here. I was trying to say it here. Okay. That's a pan we got from DL when he moved back to America. 
We might have to give all this stuff back to him when he comes back, too. I don't know how they can't stand to live for a while or just visit. I don't know. Spatula, huh? There it is. That's a first for you, huh? Fish again, huh? <laughs> Doug says he hates he hates his food looking at him too. in the rain. Go in the deep. <laughs> what? Yeah, right. You're sitting there just shivering. Freezing cold, isn't it? Feels great. Feels fantastic to me. Let's see how this fish is doing. Oh my goodness, looks good. <laughs> how do you know when it's done? Color. Oh, what, what's the color? Nice oh. and dark? This looks nice. Look at that. Wow. <laughs> it's, it, that's the water dripping off your hands, flashing. It's yeah, in the grease. <laughs> Watch out. Oh, yeah, look at that. Now it's coming along, huh? That little piece looks perfect right there. I don't want to do it. Huh? I saw you put all that spices on it. No thanks. Ready to eat? Oh, better get your plate ready. She always puts a kettle of water on top of the coals or flame. She likes to have a nice little cup of cocoa or something probably. Look at that. Wow. That looks pretty nice, really.
your sauce. No rice? Using the big plates today, huh? So we're all we're all playing in the rain like little kids today, huh? <laughs> now I feel much better now. I finally stopped sweating. I, I was feeling pretty bad. Three days in a row, it didn't stop. Real bad indigestion for some reason too. I don't know why. Three days and then yesterday a really bad headache. So I don't know. Feel good now, though. Feel just fine. Once I got cooled back down, I feel great. All right, that's a pretty fancy dinner, huh? You're soaking wet. Yeah, these two pieces here. This, that looks just like a couple little pieces of catfish. That looks fabulous. Is that the one you're going to eat? Yeah. Uh, I'm Watch out for bones. Murphy's, Murphy's father swallowed a bone a couple years ago. That was really bad. Couldn't get it out of his throat for until it finally dissolved on its own. Yes. Months. He was in when, terrible pain. When he did not go there, that he was going to the doctor. Well, I took him to the doctor. Yes. I took him to the doctor and I paid for his doctor. He would have just suffered. Oh. And in fact, he wound up suffering anyway, but that, at least we tried. Mm. Alright, see what it's like. A little more sauce, huh? It's mm. <laughs> like that. I don't know if you ever noticed, but Filipinos take extra big bites. I don't know, never could understand that. She'll put so much in Shanna's mouth that she can't even hardly breathe. It's sticking out her cheeks like a chipmunk. <laughs> I, I try to keep telling them, don't do that, but it's, it's just the way they are here, I guess. Because using our hands. Yeah, but it doesn't make a difference what, what you use. You don't need that much. Yeah. I'm trying to look at Shannon for when she gets older and she's around... I don't want to say regular people, but <laughs> American people, whatever, they won't understand the big mouths, big mouthfuls. Oh. So thank you. Something. Mm -hmm. Good, huh? Mm -hmm. All right. Success then, huh? Success, yes. All right. All right. Well, I want to thank everybody for watching another episode of Cooking with Marfi. <laughs> and uh, please click like and subscribe. And by all means, share our videos. Put some links out on Facebook for us if you would. Whatever you can. You can contact us anytime at blindowloutdoors at gmail.com. And say? Thanks for watching. God bless you. Okay. Bye. Thank you very much and have a nice day. Bye. Thanks for watching. Take care.